above, middle of, inside of the nostril. Your eyebrow should begin there. Outside corner of the nose, corner of the eye should end there. Tip of the nose, middle of the iris. This should be the highest part. That's the golden ratio. Cool. I'm Jenna Rosenstein, and this is The Beauty Show. And on today's episode, we're going inside the global headquarters of Anastasia Beverly Hills. Get a look at her billion dollar beauty empire. So let's go take a look. Well, hello, Jenna. Welcome to my office. It's beautiful. Designed it myself. Not surprising. Well, I can't wait to dig into your beauty stash. Of course. <laughs> I'm so happy that you are here and we could share. I could okay. share everything. Yes. Now well, let's start with the history of okay. Anastasia Beverly Hills. Oh, I'm so excited. So in 1999, I launched a full makeup line in the salon. So not only the um, eyebrow products were the ones that I wanted to launch at the beginning because they were not products for eyebrows. This category didn't exist in early 1990s. Yeah, you were the you first. Believe. You yes. were the first. <laughs> I reinvented eyebrows. You did. So those three were, this was the loose powder, press powder, and blush and trio eyeshadow. Were those the first product? Everything. Everything was. came out at yes, once? Yes, at okay. once. Okay. The bottle was custom Oh done and the cap. So extremely expensive yeah. packaging. I had no idea because I didn't know anything about uh, beauty industry. And, and you've uh, always been doing it yourself. Like this yes. is what makes your brand so... Completely. Unique. Right. Here we have the brow kit. I call the brow book. Okay. And the reason why I started putting that together was in 99, Poppy Montgomery, I don't know if you are familiar with, with she's a beautiful actress. Mm -hmm. She was going in Canada to do a Marley Moreau movie, a beautiful uh, thick eyebrows. And as you know, Marley Moreau had very beautiful thick eyebrows. Right. And she said, well, I'm going to go there and I don't know if my makeup artist will know how to keep the shape. So I said, let me go to the art store and find a sheet of plastic. I will cut us like a form which was a stencil, and I started um, uh, mixing some Vaseline with aloe vera and some powder and kind of give her in the plastic uh, uh, bag this, this kit. Right. So five months later, she came back. She said, oh my God, this was amazing. It worked so great. You should do something. And I, and I thought, you know what? I'm in LA in Beverly Hills. Not everybody has access to this. Maybe right. I should create a kit. And this is what the kit. Oh, wow. But that was the first time when I said, well, the whole concept of Vibra is you apply the product and then you blend with the spoolie. Mm -hmm. So why should you have two separate brushes? We should do one double-ended. Right. And this is what happened. So, and so these were these sets were sold in Nordstrom? Yes, okay. in my salon in Beverly Hills okay. and in Nordstrom. Became. So in 2007, we launched in Sephora. Mm -hmm. And then everything changed. Everything <laughs> changed. And Instagram for us was absolutely the best vehicle. Because you're still of, like the most followed brand on Instagram, right? Well, we were the first brand we wanted to expand. And of course, my daughter came with the idea of slowly creating something out of it. All these years working with me, she came to me and one day she said, Mom, let's do a contouring because contouring is the second most important element if you learn how to do it right, right. to create that perfect proportion. Mm -hmm. Let me show you a few of my stash okay. here. 2013, I wanted to create this bold and beautiful. This is very art deco. Oh. This was a palette and this was for eyebrows. Yep with little poma there and color. It's like a mini version. Sort it's of a mini kit. version, exactly. Mm -hmm. Right now, I think everybody's using makeup every day. A woman that knows, learns how to do her makeup, I think we empower her. She, she feels beautiful, mm -hmm. she, she feels confident. Right now, I think women use makeup every single day. And it doesn't have to be a dramatic smoke. No. Yeah, you can just be doing your eyebrows. Completely. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. So we start doing um, collaboration with the makeup artists on Instagram because we realized it was a community. Instagram became a community of people and uh, we wanted to, to show the support. Right. Usually what we do with a palette, it's a quad. So you have to think of the quad. Mm, so you're not, you're not jump. you can yeah. if you want. I, you could do whatever right. you want, but okay? But to you. make it easier, you see, this is a look, mm -hmm. this is another look, and this is another look, and you could go the other way back. Right. 
So all our palettes are like that. That's really cool. Yes. I see soft glam there. That's my favorite palette of yours. Really? Yeah. Okay, still one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. The colors, I mean, when I saw her first, mm -hmm. like red, are you crazy? <laughs> Who is going to wear that red? So we have the Browis, as you know. I mean, is, everyone on the planet uses this. Yes. You know that, right? Like everyone. The mm -hmm. brush is custom. It's designed to blend perfectly the texture of the pencil. Mm. But every batch, I still approve it. Oh, just to make sure the quality Huge. is still Absolutely. There. Every wow. time when we order another batch, I have to approve it first. They will use the same formula. But mm. remember, the raw materials I, are bought by companies. There are few companies mm. all over the world. But let's say yellow, you will buy one time from Brazil. And next time, maybe you will buy from Spain. I'll give you an example. Yellow is from the soil, right. okay? Maybe in Brazil, the soil has little green in it. Oh, so minor and in, differences. So, like yeah. so tiny. Mm -hmm. So when they start mixing, the color is not the same. Wow. It's like a tiny little thing. So, so every batch that you order? Every you batch. I uh, checked all the batches for eyebrow products and my daughter for makeup. Oh. Every single one. Now we get into the, the glow. The glow. <laughs> so we were, of course, at the beginning, the first one to create the, the kits. The dream is, is really cool because you could use it as a shadow. Yeah, it's like holographic. And it's holographic. Oh, it's Look so beautiful. beautiful. Yeah. Innovation for us, we like, this is what we want to do. Mm -hmm. We don't want to do what everybody else does. We want to create trends. Mm -hmm. And we created, of course, trend with eyebrows, right. then with contouring, then with highlighting. Then we like to, to think outside of the box. Mm -hmm. And if we are not 100% happy or us in love with, we'll never launch. Mm. Well, I can't wait for that to <laughs> launch the mascara. I'm so excited. This is everything about eyebrows. Every eyebrow product that I made. It's heaven. But this was in 2017, 20 years of. Wow. I would drop $5,000 on something like this. <laughs> and what then, is this? this is the contour book. This was a PR package as well. Uh, you have every color that you could use to contour. So fun. I'm sure makeup yes. artists loved this. Oh my God. Yeah. No, Kim Kardashian called me like, do you think I could have one and for my mom too? I'm like, of course. Sure, Kim, anything. Yes, <laughs> yes. And we have Lisa Edward. We love her. These are some colors. And Whoa. some colors. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes. Look at that yellow brick road. It's I mean, beautiful. yellow brick road. Do you know Lisa Edward? Yeah. From the drag race. Mm -hmm. You know, we sponsored drag race from the beginning and we love her mm -hmm. on the show, I think. She mm -hmm. has so much personality and she is she knows how to put a show yeah definitely and knows how to make a palette she yes <laughs> she chose the colors very much. i love that you're so open to collaborating with new talent and new faces absolutely and, yeah. we are i think we were the first um, brand that ever supported men mm -hmm. to me it's an art i mean when we start um, posting on our instagram guys doing their makeup i said Hold on a second. You are a woman and you could do your makeup at 12 o'clock at night and you could post. But if you're a guy, you can't get a, uh, a model at 11 o'clock at night to pay. And right. it's like, why you cannot put <laughs> makeup on yourself? Right. It's just the technique that you need to, to admire and right. to learn from. And I'm happy because it's just an art form. Makeup, it's art form. Mm -hmm. And when you're talking about like the technical elements of golden ratio, Completely. Like drag queens this have is, been doing that they, for forever. I right. think they know contouring better than anybody. Mm -hmm. So why we should not celebrate that? Definitely. So both my parents have very, very sparse brows, so I don't really do much really? to them. Yeah. Actually, you have really beautiful face, oval, or almost according to your bone structure, from the hairline wow. to the eyebrow base of the nose and chin, those three zones should be equal. And yours are quite equal. Thank you. This is a high arch stencil. You connect number one here, Mark. You keep this parallel to the ground and you start filling in exactly where your eyebrow should end. You. you brush to blend the excess. Do you see this part here? Mm -hmm. Oh wow, it's instant. If the, the product is not dry, 
it's going to smear on your face. Uh -huh. I think you are missing a little hair there. Mm -hmm. No. I'm sure you see both. I'm sure you see people who have overgrown eyebrows, and I'm sure you yes. see people who have of course. none. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, it's oh, amazing, no? I'm speechless. Wow. I mean, I have a different face. <laughs> All right, well, we're gonna finish up the other eyebrow now, so I don't have just one gorgeous eyebrow, but two. But thank you so much for having us here uh, today. Of course, thank you so much for coming oh. and being in Anastasia Beverly Hills land here. <laughs> I loved it, we learned so much. Thank you. All right, let's do this. It's like a guy. Yes. <laughs>